incredible and shocking event in Mexico. Before starting, we invite you to like the video, that way you help us inform. The Archdiocese of Morelia, capital of the Mexican state of Michoacan, made a statement about an image of the Virgin of Guadalupe which allegedly has tears of blood flowing from it. According to local media, the alleged prodigy occurred on Sunday, June 2nd, Election Day in Mexico, when the Melcher Mondragon family noticed something unusual on their image of the Virgin of Guadalupe in their home. One of the sons noticed the reddish tears on the face of the figure. The family decided to contact the Catholic priest of the nearest church, Father José de Jesús Alcazar, parish priest of the Holy Trinity in the city of Morelia, so that he could attest to the event. The Mexican Archdiocese specified this June 6 that it is too early to issue a definitive position on the matter. However, it indicated that the necessary measures are being taken to investigate the situation in a deep and exhaustive manner. Angel David Arias, director of communications of the Archdiocese of Morelia, pointed out that the Catholic Church has always been characterized by its prudence in such matters, avoiding disqualifications or gratuitous affirmations without the necessary foundation. The priest invited the faithful and the media to be cautious when dealing with such a delicate subject as that of an alleged miracle. Regarding the presence of the parish priest in the house where the image is kept, Father Arias clarified that his visit had the sole purpose of attending spiritually to the family that sent for him. This, in no way, confirms anything in this regard, so he himself asked to treat the issue with appropriate discretion, while he invited them to take advantage of this moment to motivate their own conversion and family prayer, said the person in charge of communication of the Archdiocese of Morelia. The communique was published after the diffusion of versions in local media that assured that the priest who visited the family had confirmed the miracle. The spokesman of the archdiocese informed that a team will be set up to carry out a detailed study of the case, and as soon as there is a relevant conclusion it will be made public. The Dicastery for the Doctrine of the Faith published on May 17 the new norms for proceeding in the discernment of alleged supernatural phenomena. The new norms published by the Vatican establish a procedure to be followed by diocesan bishops, who are responsible for examining the cases in dialogue with their respective Episcopal Conference and under the supervision of the Dicastery for the Doctrine of the Faith. The conclusion as to whether it is a miracle or not will be reserved to the Pope. <laughs>